Well, I hope from that sample alone you guys can hear how great these strings sound. I think this is like the true sweet point of the of the octocores. Um, about a weekend. I don't actually remember the last time I recorded the video. I'm pretty sure I changed them last Tuesday and it's Tuesday again. Uh, uh, yeah, these strings are amazing. They sound absolutely incredible. They are exactly what you what I want a mandolin to sound like at this point. Uh, and you know the tuning stability is just ridiculous like if those are your two biggest things and you can like adjust any feel i don't see why you would go with another string and these are just like the these are just like the 11 to 40s uh and the cool thing about the octocores is that you can get them in any size you want so uh if i wanted to move up to like 11 and a half uh 16 26 and, and 40 i could do that custom mediums or something like that Yo, know, heavies, it's not a big deal. I literally get to specify whatever size I want. Uh, yeah, the only drawback to these uh, is that feel. And I mean, as I play them in a bit more, it does it does get a little easier. Like, they, they have less resistance now. The, uh, the, the A and E strings definitely, like, from the beginning, are aren't that resistant or anything like that. It's really once you get into like th that G string that you're just like. If you're big on sliding on that, it might annoy you and the coated strings are gonna be the fix for that. Uh, but yeah, uh, really impressed. As far as like, this is like, like as far as sound goes, it's it's like a 10 out of 10. May, it may, I'll give it like a nine and a half out of 10 because I've actually considered moving up to a heavier gauge, especially now that I've been using a, uh, a tone slab uh, pick, which uh, I'm kind of obsessed with this so far. Um, yeah, so I'm considering moving up because I, I do think that the sound could be even better now, so those custom mediums might be on the way. Uh, and uh, as far as like tuning stability, it's like a 10 out of 10, because if it's possible to do 11 out of 10, I would give it, like, because there's no strings that stay in tune like these. It's crazy. Uh, and as far as like the feel, I'd give this probably like, ah, I'd probably give it like an 8 out of 10. That's my gut feeling. It's pretty good. So anyway, yeah, uh, probably my last week on these. As soon as those string joys get in, I'm probably going to go ahead and switch to them uh, rather than the two, me two, two whole weeks on the, on the octocores. But, uh, yeah, I'm just excited for the string joys just to see what I think. But yeah, uh, Mapes, Octocores, not surprised that they're just, they're just awesome. They really are. So anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching and tuning in. Don't hit, don't forget to subscribe. I really appreciate it.